Hello everybody and welcome back to Rebus Gaming HD. We're back on Dynasty Warriors 8. This is the Wei story and this is the Battle of the Yan Province. As you can see I'll be using Dian Wei who's level 25 and some standard weapons as usual. Nothing special. Two four stars. And this battle, I couldn't find much in terms of this actual battle itself. It's quite a lot of battles in the Yan Province but this battle is to recruit Zuzu. Well, Juzu. Can't remember if that's correct. So, the idea of this is, well, the main idea of this battle is to wipe out the remaining yellow turbans. But we do come across a big fellow, and we decide to recruit him into our ranks. So this battle is not actually very long at all. So I'll be trying to be quick and go through the majority of stuff like I normally do. So I'm coming up against Liu Pu, and I am. Um, I don't know. Dian Wei, pretty solid character. Got no problems with this guy at all. He's a right beast. Um, he has a. If you do a, a standard triangle attack, you'll give yourself a nice little boost to everything. I think as well as giving yourself the ability to when you hit when you hit people, the spin. So this is Zuzu, the strange big man. So we take him out. Take him out again. There's my, me using that little booster. Nice little switch counter going on there. And once we take this guy out, that's just, that's it. Yeah. So you do it. They spin around. It's like the attack is so strong you can't do much about it. I believe this is his alternate move. So he gives him a couple of headbutts and then smashes him. And the first one is um, he kind of does three attacks and he grabs the guy and throws them over themselves just getting away from that move to attack because that would be nasty I've got no problems with this guy at all level 25 absolutely destroying these guys they don't stand a chance uh, Dian Wei has got some serious attack I have no problems with him at all brilliant character uh, not my favorite but definitely one I would not mind playing over and over again and that was the oh, that was the normal move so there this is all sped up because um, I'm just trying to wipe out these privates and my unit gets trapped as you'll see I can start walking with these guys after take out this unit commander and then boom, unit commander, mobile unit captain sorry the gates stop me from going on so I kind of just have to wait around until the gate is open here and I can take out Bian Z and Yan Zhang Zheng. move up, this is the jumping move so coming up again pretty, pretty solid um, all his attacks are uh, very good in terms of area of effect, especially his standard Muso and his jumping Muso and his alternate Muso is very focused on PvP and does some serious damage. I don't even have to use um, the affinity counter trick to take these guys out, they really don't stand a chance. And that booster for you know boosting your skills. It just, it, it, I think it doubles his attack for a very short amount of time as well as his defense speed and gives him that very strange power that I can't say I've seen it before and I nearly died then. Don't go rushing in, no better. Let's see what his rage is like. Again, really powerful, you got a little bit of a screen shake going on there. And yeah, not the best move so in the world but it's definitely got the power behind it. I took over half he, he Yi's life there and that we're just on the final part of the rage part. So I'm going to do a switch counter on him there, get a nice little booster, also double my booster here. And I'm going to just wipe him out. I'd, I mean that, that, you, you're unstoppable when you do that booster, there's, there's no challenge to you whatsoever because even if they're defending you hit them and they get taken, they, get, they start spinning so the enemy officers don't stand a chance against you at all. I'm just taking these privates out so my allies can catch up and they don't have to worry about fighting all this fodder. So what do you guys think of Dian Wei? Like I said, solid character, no problems with this guy. Not my favourite, his rage is okay in terms of damage output but speed and maybe the attack counts could be better. So we're moving on to Zhang Yan. Like I said, let me know in the comments what you think. Moving on to Zhang Yan, as I said, once we take this guy out, Zhu Zhu will appear again, or Zhu Zhu will appear again, and once you kill him, that's the end of the battle. 
well, killing, defeat him. I'll stop saying killing. And this guy just doesn't want to stand up. He's crying, so I'll finish him off with a uh, jumping room. So uh, he's out of the way. Oh, that's what we're doing. Yeah, we're rounding up the yellow turbans and recruiting them at the same time. So we're beating them, and then they're getting recruited. That's the objective of this battle. So that explains why we also recruited Zushi. So we'll finish him off with a rage, hopefully. It's gonna be close. Ah, we got him. Well, that's it. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next episode.